Hi, my name is Fallon, and I'm here today with Chegg Tutors to talk to you about the sociological idea of rational choice theory. Um, basically, what rational choice theory says is that people behave the way they do because they believe that their chosen actions have more benefits than cost. So basically, people make rational choices based on the goals that they have, and those choices govern their behavior. Um, rational choice theory has basis has a basis in um, economics and political theory as well as sociology. Uh, sociologists use it to explain how people decide to act on a behavior, so how they weigh the benefits and costs, as well as how the calculations of the benefits and costs are made, so through social interaction, and also how the rationalization behind action contributes to stable social order. So how the choices that people make, um, according to this theory through rational choices, contributes to the stability of society. Um, this theory also says that social change results from rational choices. So an example of that would be um, people deciding to conserve energy by lowering the temperature on their thermostat and driving less because these things help them reach their own goals of saving money and being healthier, so walking as opposed to driving, for example. Um, so those are the benefits, and they also don't have a ton of inconvenience to go along with those things, so there aren't very many costs. Therefore, the benefits of saving money and being healthy coming from lowering their thermostat and driving less um, outweigh the costs that they perceive their then maybe they have to leave a little earlier for work, but no major costs there. Um, so they make the rational decision to conserve energy by doing those things as opposed to making an irrational decision, which would ignore the benefits and just pay attention to the costs. Um, so rational choice can be used to explain crime. It can be used to explain how people make day-to-day uh, what we would consider to be typical decisions. Um, again, the rational choice theory says that when people make a decision, it's because the benefits of that decision outweigh the cost. So another example would be stealing. Say someone is hungry, and they can either steal and get food or not steal and starve. Um, and say they have a kid, so they also need food for their child. At that point, the benefits of stealing might outweigh the cost because the benefit means that they and their child get to eat and maybe they steal something healthy, so get to eat something nutritious as opposed to the cost of maybe getting arrested, maybe going to jail, maybe paying a fine because they perceive the benefits of eating to be so much higher than the cost. So their rational decision is then to steal. Um, rational choice theory has been criticized somewhat for assuming that humans are always rational. Um, so the critics of this theory say that people don't always make weighed out pro con decisions and that sometimes they just make snap decisions that haven't really taken into account all of the benefits and costs of a decision. So to summarize, rational choice theory says that people behave the way they do because they believe that the actions that they choose have more benefits than costs. If you have any other questions, feel free to get in touch with me or another Chegg Tutor. Thanks so much.